Let's take a look at the oxidation number for iron in iron 3 chloride. And the fact that it's iron 3 chloride, that should give you a clue to the oxidation number for iron. So with our iron 3 chloride here, we should note there's no negative or positive sign after it. That means it's a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers, they're going to add up to zero. And kind of the trick to figuring this one out is realizing that the chlorite ion right here, it has an ionic charge of one minus. So you kind of have to know that or be able to look it up. When we have an ion, all of the oxidation numbers, they're going to add up to the charge on the ion. So we know that all of the oxidation numbers here for the chlorite ion, they're going to be minus one. Since we have three chloride ions, that's minus three. The iron, it has to be a positive three for all the oxidation numbers to add up to zero. So the oxidation number for the iron in iron three chloride, that's plus three. And that makes sense. We're calling it iron three chloride because of this three right here. If you need help figuring out the oxidation number for the chlorine here in the chloride ion, there's a link at the end of this video to help you. This is Dr. B with the oxidation state for the iron in iron three chloride. It's plus three. Thanks for watching.